Hi, my name is Sherry Clown. I'm the Air Director for Residence Life. I'm here today to announce the winner of the Rookie of the Year Award. This award is given to a first year RA who has excelled in their first year in the position. The recipient of this award has built a strong community amongst their residents, has worked effectively as a team member amongst their staff, and has demonstrated exceptional contributions to their residential community. The following RAs have been nominated for this award. Lauren Lang, Brenna Dawson, Caitlin Corrigan, Sam Edgel, Trent Grotolution, McKenna Hancock, Hope Lewis, Cam Lowther, and Adelaide St. John. The nominator had to say this about the winner of this award. This person deserves the Rookie of the Year Award because they continuously exceeded expectations. Even when they were juggling with many things throughout the year, they were intentional with all of their residents in and outside of the hall. In addition to building intentional relationships with their residents, this person was eager to learn, ask questions, and confront situations. As a team player, they were great at communicating with the staff and always brought their positive attitude to every interaction. They're also one of the RAs that will stop and say hi to the RA on duty to make sure they are holding in there. Finally, this person deserves the Rookie of the Year Award because they used this position to grow personally and get outside of their comfort zone in several ways, which has made them an RA that is always ready to learn something from the job. Congratulations, Caitlin Corrigan, for winning Rookie of the Year. From Residence Life, we had two nominations for RA Program of the Year, which were Try as Escape Room and Divorce Ice Cream Sunday Bar. The nominators of the winning program had this to say about it. This program deserves the Program of the Year Award because the RAs worked diligently in the program to make sure it was a fun and team-building experience for the residents and also the other hall staffs who went through the simulation. The RAs originally got the idea during spring training and immediately knew it was something that they wanted to bring into the hall. This program was no small feat and they spent countless hours creating the puzzles and coming up with the ways to connect them all. When the students actually got the chance to go through the program, they learned how to communicate with each other and other critical thinking skills. Seeing the program from the drawing board to the finish line was truly remarkable. Congratulations to our winner, the Triad Escape Room. Hi there, I'm here to talk about the RA of the year. Uh, this individual award is given to a resident assistant who has demonstrated exceptional contributions to their residential community through program development, addressing student needs, supporting peers and senior staff, and providing leadership through crisis and emergency situations. This year, the nominees are Hugh Graham, Nate Reich, Catherine Clifford, Angel Banks, Thomas Baird, Elizabeth Perkey, and Kristen Zink. And the winner is somebody that is described as placing res life as a huge priority in their life. Um, the entire staff has, um, has known to, what to expect from this individual, um, knowing that this person really cares about them and has really cared about um, creating a great team environment. Uh, this individual um, has been always around when bad things happen and is there to support each other and celebrate um, when good things happen. This person is truly a leader on their staff, um, is truly a leader for their residents, and has done an awesome job at putting on really personalized uh, programs uh, and really cared about creating an awesome environment for everyone. And so uh, I hope you'll join me in congratulating Catherine Clifford um, as the Residence Life RA of the Year.